Hello, everybody's. For this week, all I have is a little review of uh, me and a friend of mine playtested a game that he's doing. You know, my friend Jason, he's come up with a uh, he came up with a game, Legends of Caldasia, and he's come up with his new game. It's just in the beginning stages of just playtesting it, and this I think this was his first actual playtest for the game. And we are just going to go through it. Here, hold on. And it's basically just, uh, it's where if fleets are attacking fleets instead of ships of attacking ships, and he wants it to be easier for people to play rather than the complicated, or the more complicated version of what Legends of Kaldashia is. So, we started playing, and I'd say overall first that I like to say just playtesting this um, game, I got the hang of it pretty darn quick, and I'm usually pretty slow at understanding uh, these type of miniature war game type of things, so that was a good thing. Now, to, to start out, I uh, just want to show you that, you know, we're getting ready, starting the cards up, and there's the dice and everything, and so this is basically just setting stuff up, and as you see in, like, uh, the next photo, you have, like, the two deep spaces like two map spaces to where it's like you have um, one side protecting a planet and a moon and the other side invading and I was the invaders and Jason was the planet protectors and so you have like some cards that represents the fleet of ships that are gonna go in and then start destroying peoples and so this is how we start then Let's see here we go okay so Oh, now, this photo you see, you see some pizza on the table, because that's what I decided to eat. It took a little while to get through this game. So we had some pizza for dinner, and so here we are invading, and the cool thing about, another cool thing about this is that uh, Jason had it to where you couldn't see the action, the, the other side couldn't see the actual fleets until they were revealed during attack, which is kind of an interspace thing. It's kind of cool, and as you can see, uh, I'm trying to get past his yellow ships, and here's my red invading ships trying to get past him. And how it turned out is that he actually beat me back um, at the moon uh, a little bit more than than the planet. Like the moon, I didn't have a very good strategy. He was able to keep me at bay at the moon, but the planet was the important thing. And after um, taking my forces back a little bit, I, I think the one thing that, that he actually needed to change was the fact that uh, I could get uh, reinforcements to come in and invade. So it's just basically all I had to br do is whittle down his, his fleet protecting the planet. Um, and I, I just basically won against him by, by just sheer numbers, which you can see there. And just all these ships on his side and just basically uh, took him out at the end. So... I would say overall that the, the playtesting game was fun, and I and it's going to be interesting to see what Jason comes up with in the future. I believe that this isn't going to be a miniature type setting; it's going to be more like I think card stock, and so for people just easy to download and play. And from what he's got so far, it's looking to be quite fun. I hope I'll be able to playtest it with him more in the future. But anyway. I know this is not my usual week where you don't really, you don't see anything else, you don't see much video, you just see a bunch of pictures and my voice, but not much else to speak about this week, it's pretty boring, it's still winter, it's still cold, it's still freezing. That's the way it is, and I'll see you guys next week with hopefully more video, with hopefully video uh, next time. Okay, later y'all.